Hey everybody, we're feeding them handicapping thoroughbred racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Grandville, Pennsylvania, on Saturday night, October the 29th. And this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this evening, folks, 8.29 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a five and a half furlong sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, three years old, and up race for a claiming purse of some $21,000. Contenders number one, Eclipticals Whiskey, number five, Soak Out Exchange, and number three, Diva Time, and number four, Silent Spin. Number one, Eclipticals Whiskey takes a big class drop of some 20 Trackmaster units, has hit the board in power run fashion in four of the last five, winning three times in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey David Cora and trainer David Wells under Post this evening, they've whacked the tow board with 62% of their entries saddled as a team to date. Number five, Scout Exchange, is both the overall speed and pace profile leader in this claiming field, sprinting at or about tonight's distance of five and a half for lungs on the dirt. She's posted a trio of circle trips in her last five starts, including a power run win her last time out. Race 7 summary, number 1, Eclipticals Whiskey, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 5, Scout Exchange, number 3, Diva Time, and number 4, Silence Spin, 1, 5, 3, 4, and the 7th from Penn National. Bonus long shots, Park Racing, Philly Park, Ben Salem, PA, race 6, number 7, C Street, 9 to 2 in the morning line, takes a class drop, the overall speed leader in this claiming field, racing at or about today's distance of 8.5 for lunks on the dirt. Charlestown, race 6, number 5, Colin Clyde, 9 to 2 on the morning line, drops in class by two track master units. The speed leader in this maiden field, sprinting at or about tonight's distance of 6 and 1 half furlongs on the dirt. So from Penn National on a Saturday night, you're at Gatum Ford, dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.